Yo, what's up everybody? Ketakaz here, and today I'm going to be doing a mod review on Starbound. Now, Starbound, the developer said that this game was built from the ground up to support mods, and it kind of shows because there's already mods for this game. Um, things that you would expect, or wouldn't expect, but they work in this game. So, today I'm going to be looking at a mod called the Beaker mod. Uh, basically, what this mod does, it adds a new crafting recipe into the game I guess uh, it allows you to craft a beaker which turns your food your raw alien meat and your crops into fuel so I have one crafted here uh, it's somewhere in my inventory let me find it here it goes this is the beaker this is what it looks like looks pretty awesome you have little lights like that that pulsate or whatever so I'm gonna show you guys how to make this beaker um, what you're gonna need is a furnace and you're gonna need 20 iron bars now once you open the furnace you put your 20 iron bars in there it doesn't have to be exactly 20 uh, I'm not gonna do it here because it's gonna waste my iron but what you're gonna want to do here is smelt the iron and what's gonna come out right here is a beaker it doesn't show here but as soon as you press smelt the beaker will come out and that's what you get right there is the beaker and when I click on the beaker I should be able to extract so I have some food here I have like all of this so from what I read on the description of this is that one raw alien meat will make some fuel and two of any crop makes fuel so if I extract you can see it's taking two and it is indeed making fuel and it says smells rather bad but should power my ship uh, that's pretty cool. Uh, let me see. If I press N, does it say anything? Does my character say anything about it? No. Do you say anything about the extractor? Uh, I feel like I'm being watched. Alright, that's what he says about the extractor. So, let's see if the fuel actually works. Uh, I put it in there. And you can see it actually does work. So this is pretty awesome if you have like a surplus of food. And you really need fuel, I guess then you download this beaker mod and it will turn your fuel into or turn your food into fuel uh so now i'm going to test and see if this works on multiplayer now i don't know how to install mods onto a multiplayer server uh this is for single player only right now but what i'm going to do is i'm going to break this beaker i'm going to save and quit since it's in my inventory uh i'm going to go to multiplayer and I'm going to join my friend's server and see if the beaker still works on his server. Now I'm going to beam down into my home. Uh, and let's just look for a place to put the beaker down if, it, if I still have it. So this is the beaker. I p did indeed put it down, but since it's not supported, it's not here. And it looks like I did lose the item when I did that. So don't try to take a mod and put it in a server that doesn't have the mod you will lose the item but it's okay uh so that's pretty much uh the beaker mod and to install the mod the link in the description will be to the mod and it will tell you exactly how to install the mod there you basically just install the file and put the folder that you installed into the assets folder and that's pretty much it so it's awesome. Expect more mod reviews from this game. If mods are already coming out like this, I'm going to mod I'm going to review these mods m often. So, thank you guys for watching. If you guys like my videos, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Follow me on Twitter and all that good stuff. And hey, check this out. I stole a refrigerator from some apes and I'm going to put it down right here. Hey, I need to put it in a corner. It doesn't look right right there. But whatever. I can now put my food inside the refrigerator. Anyway, Peace out!